Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we are going to interrupt our regular scheduled programming to do something a little bit different. Um, I've been hanging around on the Relentless Night Discord and it's kind of a quiet place, but there is one guy there that's posting about the Relentless Night Masochist Challenge. And I got talking with him, his name is Aaron Chang. And uh, basically over the course of um, our discussion, he ended up kind of calling me out to the challenge. He's the local uh, leader in terms of performance on this challenge. He's got 75 days survived. And I'll get into the challenge in just a sec. It's a nasty challenge. Um, I have no expectation of surviving anywhere near that long, but I will do my best. Uh, and anyway, he called me out, so I kind of have to go, right? And uh, it kind of reminded me, I had a flashback to um, that movie with Stanley Kubrick's Barry Lyndon, where um, you, you know you, a person demands satisfaction and you have to go outside and you take shots at each other with old school pistols. But um, it was a friendly ask, though. So and he seems like a good guy. If you haven't watched, uh, check out his first video. Um, first two videos on his uh, experience with the challenge. I'm going to put that in the description, the link to it. Um, anyway, I'm excited about it. It's a challenge that I was eyeballing anyway. I wouldn't necessarily jump at anybody's uh, challenge, but it's an interesting challenge. Since I've been playing around this night, I was kind of curious about it. So let's get into the settings and I'll show you what it's all about. If you haven't, if you're not aware, uh, basically, we we'll start a new game, custom game, and these are the Relentless Night settings. Um, basically, the Masochist Challenge starts with Endgame uh, Perpetual Night, so you never have daylight. So the day at which it starts is day zero. The days get longer 100%. Critical here, outdoor and indoor temperature. Indoor is only 30%. Um, So 100% of the current outdoor... Okay, so actually this is easier than the default. 30% of the current outdoor temperature will be subtracted from the indoor environment's base temperature. And let me just quickly go to the Discord. I just want to make sure that's indeed true. Yeah. So hey, that's actually easier than default. But I guess they're cutting... You know, Shieldheart's cutting us a break here. Fire heat retention's on. No realistic freezing damage, which is interesting to me because it's going to be cold. But hey, that's Shieldheart's challenge. Uh, wildlife min's out 25%. Again, higher than the default. Uh, interesting, right? And the minimum daylight uh, wildlife is at day 50. And then these are actually higher, two and two for the lantern burn time. So what um, you have to do is you run the game. So the challenge that Aaron has with me is that you have to do it on interloper. So And not custom interloper, actual interloper. So I actually ran it already once, so these settings are set. So we go back and let's just run it on straight interloper. And oh, I didn't check what Aaron take, took, but I, I believe I... I can okay. So another thing is he's playing 1.56. I'm playing 1.47. I was un I was reluctant to upgrade my game because I still have those runs going. I've got the Sleepwalkers run last night, and I didn't want to break that. And anyway, have two instances running. So he's letting me play on 1.47. He's accepting that as part of the challenge. So uh, he took Snowwalker, I think, and I think he also took Efficient Machine. Um, did he take Free Runner? Now I can't remember. I think he took Snowwalker, so I probably should have checked that. Uh, yeah, I should have checked that. Um, okay, hold tight. So let's see what he takes. Of the safe game that I had when I... Yeah, he takes Snowwalker. Okay, so I'm taking the same feats as him. That's good. So let's get started here. We're going to call this Masochist. And we will ver verify when we start that the Relentless Night settings are um, are set. But let's get started. And yeah, where it's going to be, guys. Oh, gosh. Des Desolation Point, of course. Oh, no. Uh... Yeah, this is a Desolation Point. Yeah, okay. Um, I hate Desolation Point. I just hate it. But that's the way that the cookie crumbles for me this time. Now, one thing you should note, guys, is that I um, I turned up the uh, brightness. And I talked to Aaron about it. And he's okay with that. Um, I did it just so that, you know, we're watching this together, guys, right? So... I don't want you guys to have to suffer too, too much in sheer darkness, right? It sucks watching videos at night. Normally, we kind of sleep through the nights. And in Relentless Night, I know that when I've been playing it for the nights, guys, it's been 
you know, it's been dark, so I haven't really shared those too much with you. It does give a bit of advantage to have the light up, though. And so I've told Aaron about it. If he wants to up his brightness, he can. Uh, I encourage him to do so. Okay, look at that, guys. Scarf. So don't have to worry about frostbite on my head. It's still cold in here, though, guys. Um, so there's a container over there. So yeah, this would normally be much harder to see. So I, uh, it's a little bit of a cheat to turn the brightness off. I mean, challenges typically they don't say, although I think in the, uh, the beginning of the game, basically they, they have you set it as to a certain degree of difficulty, um, by, uh, making it so that the hinterland logo disappears or whatever. So I, I don't know. I just, it was kind of a compromise. Like, first of all, I don't like blundering around in the dark. It scares me. I hate it. Secondly, um, you know, I want to make it halfway reasonable with all the YouTube uh, artifacting that happens. It's kind of like, it would be hellish for you guys just to, you'd just be listening to a voice track basically. So I made the call and Aaron was cool with it. So uh, he'll probably do the same, hopefully. I hope he does, because I can't see what's going on in his videos. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we're doing our little right and search here. Never really a, a big turnout. Ooh, guys, and the beds don't even do it for me. Plus three, so ain't no point in staying here. I'm going to get moving. Uh, over to Hibernia, where I think there's a guaranteed match spawn. Sardines, excellent. So we're going to be taking cold damage, guys, big time. That's just how it is. That's uh, Relentless Night for you. That's Permanite. It's just, it's a fact. I don't love it, but it just is. And the only saving grace is this is not a Sleepwalker. It's, um, it's Interloper. I miss Interloper. Interloper with its profound condition recovery. Um, profound condition recovery. I could have gone to that uh, truck over there, but see, it's actually quite nice when you turn the brightness up. Like the night is actually almost daylight, which I thought would be, you know, I mean, uh, it's, I'm torn, right? The nighttime does add to the difficulty a lot, but I, oh, the wolves are out, guys. But I just hate the night though, you know, I hate it. So this is my concession. I've nerfed it a little. Um, I don't know. You guys let me know what you think. If you really want me to, I will do a, a darkness run, but I don't want to. There's that loon, guys. That's the loon that gave me my name. That's the loon's loon out there. When I was, uh, one of my early interloper runs came through here and uh, I heard that awesome loon's call. It's a great call. Just, oh, this is, okay, so much for indoors being bright. Never mind. I can't see anything. I can't even loot this, guys. I, I'll get lost in here and die. We gotta go. I was crazy. So never mind. The brightness setting doesn't really help with uh, contrast all that much. I gotta go. About to take damage here. And here it comes. Percentage lost and counting. Yeah, and we're not gonna be getting warm anytime faster. Okay, so this is nice and bright. Okay, so I gotta get, let's see what we got here. Is this bed gonna be, okay, plus five, let's do it. Just to take that bit of edge off there. Wow, ugly, ugly. So yeah, those are always bad. Let's take a look over here. Sometimes, yeah, there's my matches, guys, ha. And a wet zone. So DP is kind of a crappy place to start. I mean, it's good and bad. It's like, there are good things about DP. Um, it's a fair bit of loot. Um, it's nice to never have to come back here again. I don't, I wanna, I think thinking about what my strategy is gonna be, we'll see, but I'm tempted to just to bang for Mystery Lake, which is my place of, of great comfort. And we'll do another hour sleeping. Yeah, we'll just see how it goes, guys. I'm gonna roll with it. I I'm admittedly scared. Like, um, so with the Sleepwalker Relentless Night, you know, we're on day um, 60 or something. Oh, two packs of matches, guys. Oh my. 
That is something. That's amazing. So anyway, um, relentless night sleepwalker uh, run. You know, I've been kind of dreading this relentless the uh, perma night. It's been coming, and I've been dreading it. And uh, here we, you know, so I was kind of doing insane prep trying to get ready for it, and here we are just tossed in, eh? Anyway, I couldn't turn Aaron down. He uh, again, I had as I said, I had the flashback to Barry Lyndon. And, you know, I think in Barry Lyndon, uh, the guy that plays Redmond Barry goes out and he ends up getting shot in the leg. And, oh, it got darker, eh? Uh-oh. He gets shot in the leg and he loses his leg. So, I uh, felt like there was something there, but there's no left behind. Here's the thing, guys. I don't think I have any firewood yet. Uh, I have, okay, I've got some coal. So I'm going to say that we are probably going to do that. Cool. Um, okay. Oh, here comes this part. It's 26. Twenty six thirty four. There it is. We can use this. Oh, that's excellent. Wow, guys. Please tell me we're above. No, we're not. Ugh. So I'm hoping I'm not missing a tool here. Sometimes there's a tool here. I think what we're going to do is start a fire. Uh, I don't know if I can... Oh, pry bar, guys. I don't know if I can start a fire with just straight coal. I might be able to, but it's nice to have a stick, isn't it? Pry bar is a good find. That's a good find early, definitely. Okay, actually, I think there's some reclaimed out. Okay, that was nothing. <laughs> it's a bed, eh? Plus three bed. Gotta keep it's very dark in here all of a sudden. Like so I'm I'm curious about this whole relentless night thing, permanent, whether it's like actually always the same or if there's variation in the, the light level. That I'm not sure. Um Oh there's my torch guys, okay. So Oh and another pack of matches. So sorry Aaron. <laughs> I'm sorry man, like I know you're gonna be jealous when you see that. That was uh that was a good thing. Let's get that fire going, get some water on figure stuff out um, but yeah I will say that's an unusually good okay I pressed it once but I just heard the click and it's a hundred percent torch so oh and a book oh no tinder guys oh no no oh it's gonna be close oh okay that's an, a really long torch I forgot about tinder oh no oh I forgot about Tinder. It's because I've been playing my level 5 character, so... Okay. Okay, okay. Let's get some sanity back here, guys. So, what am I going to do? What do I need? I need a lot of heat. Let's go ahead and toss the coal in. Find more. And uh, let's start making a couple torches. And we'll do a proper search here, guys. So, I'm going to put some water on right away. It's nice that they start you with the can. I feel like that's a major concession. They didn't have to do that for us. What's that? No, nothing. Better get, I better go over this with a torch. So let's um, find that amazing torch. It's out there somewhere. Oops. Oh, not that one. But we will get sticks out of it, so. There we are. That's that torch. Sounds like a blizzard outside, guys. Oh, lost my good torch spot. Oh, a blizzard. Okay, so we're going to go do a search. That's too bad. Oh, a flare, see? Now I'm glad I, I should probably go do the upstairs again. Um, but we'll go there. Eh, let's do the upstairs. Yeah, look and listen to that, guys. It's ugly. Um, 
I remember I always have flashbacks to uh, Stalker where you can find a rifle under the. I hope you can't fall through the floor there. Find a rifle under that bed. It's, it's always so good. Yeah, one thing about DP, there's not that much. Uh, there's not that. There's I don't know. There's very few cattails, if any. I can't remember now, but there might be a couple. But you're kind of on your own for Tinder. So. Wow, we're still getting a heat up from here. So that's it's incredible. Okay, let's try to f let's try to sort this out. There's a blizzard going, so there's no point in rushing out. Although. I really would like to keep this fire going. Though honestly, with this many matches, guys, it's kind of like hell's bells with the matches. Oh, there, we'll take that. Oh, can I? Oh, guys, they're gonna, they're gonna block me. They're gonna block me. There might be a way to do that, but I'm not gonna finick with it for an empty box. This is the one place I really want to know what's what. Nothing. Okay. Oh, okay. Granola bar. Old MRE that somebody ate. Oh, painkillers, okay. But they're rumored to be a, a bedroll spawn here, guys. I've never seen it in my time, but yeah, wouldn't that be nice, eh? Bedroll spawn. Uh, I gotta just push it out of my head. Now, there's also um, old what's his name's cave. Fluffy, Scruffy, his cave. I think there's a bedroll spawn in there, possibly. I. Uh, I'm just going to be honest. I don't want to go there, you know? I, I don't think I can do it. I just... Okay, there's a fair bit of reclaim stashed around in here. And this one is a slow tube. I shouldn't have gone in here, but... There's fast tubes and slow tubes, guys, and this is a slow tube. Um... Yeah, I don't know. You know, like Scruffy, really, do I? A book? Okay. Sometimes there's a thing over there. Another tool, tool case. I know that there's possibly a hacksaw spawn in here. That's what I'm looking for. I think I already looked at the spot where it could show up. But, you know, hope springs eternal that there's another stash. So yeah, let's go back and see what's happening with the fire. I, I could break a crate or two down. We'll do a little bit of tinder prep just because, you know, almost got burned there by it. What's up? Okay, put another one on. Try to get some good water going here. And I did not... Oh, I got my tool, which is my, my pry bar. So what we're going to do, guys, is um, do a little tinder breakdown. Let's do that now. Where's the tinder breakdown? This thing. Newsprint. I thought I picked up... Oh, I only got the one. Okay. It'd be great to hear that thing go down. Blizzard. Okay, here's a sick idea. Here's a sick idea. 47 minutes. Okay, guys, I'm having a sick idea. So one of the strategies I've had in the other game... Oh, let's break that down. One minute till melted. Okay. Let's go ahead and can I cook a? Yeah. Let's do a tomato soup. Banged up. We're gonna have to wait on. So one of the strategies I had um, is to run from place to place in the blizzard because there's no wolves. Now that's a big gamble here. But I'm still gonna do it because. You know, the, the big gauntlet in this map is to go from here to the connecting cave uh, out of here. So, although I should really do another water, shouldn't I? I really should do another water. Although I have another half a liter, guys. Okay, I have to do another water. So we'll see what happens with the blizzard. I just can't go around with that little water. Hour and 20. Okay, so let's do... Let's go do an hour. Hoping that the water doesn't boil off. I think it will, though. 
She's counting on this blizzard being long. Oh, it got bad. Listen to that. Okay, that water's gonna boil off. Ah, one minute. There you go. So, uh, 16 minutes, eh? Try to make good on this. Um, that might do it. 19. Oh, okay, you can take my last stick. Am I going to do that or not? I guess I want the water, right? That's, that's how it is, so. There's, I don't think there's embers on this thing. I don't. I can't trust it, so. And I better break a stick down because... Break a torch because... Because that is that is what it is, right? Uh, so let's go accelerate. I'm not even going to bother with the lit torch because... We got ourselves a blizzard, so let's just go. And we'll see what we see outside. Bound to be ugly. Feeling a little slow for some reason. My character's kind of plodding along here. Only got I'm light, so no reason for it. But okay, prepare to get cold, guys. But here's the gamble: is it a wolf free zone? Let's pop in here. Oh, that's dark. Oh, that's dark. Can I see anything? Now, now I wish I had. I guess I could do the torch, eh, guys? Yeah, I'm gonna need it for the cave anyway, right? So let's do that. Let's, uh. Oh, hey. Yeah, I think it's worth doing. Uh, the. Oh, am I gonna want the flare for. to get through, uh, crumbling? Maybe. But I, I really need to check. I have to check what's in here, so. Let's do this. It feels weird, but. They're really heavy, these flares, so better just to get rid of it. Use it, use it, right? Use it. And it's nothing, yeah. That's, oh, okay. Okay, I got a piece of reclaimed wood, guys, so feel good about that. Um, okay, let's go. Ugly, ugly, ugly. But yeah, see, this thing can't get blown out, so... Hey, that's right. Nothing in the back. Let's go. Very beautiful out in this uh, flare light. Okay. I really hope that wolf spawn is. The wolves go home. I think they do. Bandage, hey, that's good. Okay, let's go. Okay, so... Hacksaw would have been nice, but... You get these, but... No can do. Nasty weather. Come on. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, really nasty weather. Yeah, I hear you, man. Okay, we're gaining, guys. Gaining in here with the torch. Okay, so let's go, let's go. Try to make some headway here. And now that we're, okay, now that we're, like, committed, we don't have, um, we don't have a bed now, although, guys, it occurs to me that that same trick, oh, tricky, could hold for the, oh, there's my hacksaw, okay, we're going right back. Let's 
The same, the same trick could hold for the lighthouse guys. Wouldn't that be swell? Warming up expired. Yeah, let's get the hack out of here. Yeah, now wouldn't that be swell, guys? If I can make the uh, the old lighthouse in the blizzard. Now, I seriously doubt that my uh, flare is going to go till there. But wait, maybe I'll find another flare. We'll just see. Now, they, sometimes they sneak stuff in and around here, so I should really spend the time to look. Um, but yeah, let's go. Like I don't want to get too hung out. I got my hacksaw, guys. So we're really, really interested in the bedroll. I think we'll do a quick warm-up fire before we go. Um, I probably won't make it with the, uh, the old flare all the way. Although, I'm going to take some cold damage if I do that. But, the, i got to remember, guys, that this is going to be counterintuitive to me. I have to actually learn to take cold damage. Because in Sleepwalker, you just can't. You just can't. So I'm used to just flying by the seat of my pants, trying to stay, uh, you know, warm. But with this mode, it's like, hey man, we're going to heal, so don't panic. Oh, Cotton Tube, not as good as my Double Scarf, I don't think, but I'm going to go for it because we're actually kind of, I'm going to take some cold damage here, guys, on the premise that, yeah, on the premise that it's a freebie. There goes the, there goes the, uh, okay, that's not good. So we're using a match, oh well. I wonder if it blows up faster in the wind. Over here. No, oh, 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 oh. Oh, guys. It's further yet. Now I'm paying for it. Now I'm paying for it. Where is that bloody lighthouse? Over here, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, so one thing I noticed about Aaron is he's got amazing navigation skills. He knows this place so well. I can't tell where I'm at in this weather. It's like... Okay, that was hellish, guys. So it didn't... That backfired properly on me. Okay, let's get... Let's get going here. the light here's it gonna be let's do it light it up uh, not using use the book save that let's do a stick five tinder go come on, 
If I had accelerant, I'd use it. Toss a coal on. Although, you know what? We don't. Well, let's save our coal. We've got, got all the cedar and stuff. We don't need it. It's already warm in here, so. And we're gonna sleep for a while. So let's do some searching. We're heating up now. Extreme pressure's off. Bandage. Good to have. See, I don't have to tear any cloth down now. The old search. Uh, okay. Uh, let me just. Oh, yeah. What am I doing, guys? I just had like a, mi a mini flashback of like forgetting my can. Hey, Blizzard just ended. Sounds like. A stem. Definitely welcome. Take that stem. I know I'm going to use it. And here's the thing, guys. Finding that pry bar is the first... Oh! Big drawer, guys. Find the pry bar is... Oh, there's my accelerant. Good to have. Anyway, let me finish the thought. Find, finding the pry bar is the first thing means... All of these lockers. There we go. All these trunks. Everything along the way. I would say that this is a pretty good start I got. Because it's going to be a smorgasbord, basically... Um, from here to, if I make it, I mean, I gotta get through crumbling first, God, which is gonna be rough, but from here to, uh, old, uh, oh, loons are out. That's a good sign. I don't know why I do this. This is like a, uh, stalker memory going there, but, uh, yeah, basically, um, uh oh, okay, light. I would, that would be troublesome if you're here in the dark. Okay, got the hypothermia thing fixed. But yeah, it's a stalker memory, finding bullets out there. I did play stalker. I did I did like it. It was fun. But uh, yeah, here we are. Okay, so four hours on that thing. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. Can we do any... Um, do some more tinder breakdown. Gonna need it. I feel like it got colder in here. Eight minutes, so let's see what the situation is. Frostbite's going down. Oh, it's 19 in here, guys. It's beautiful. Um, be nice to read all those books and get rid of them. I don't want to carry them with me, but we are still light, so. And I got the other thing that's going to be a trick about this whole run is I got a starf, which is so counterintuitive now. Yeah, so I think what we're going to do is sleep in our rushes, although actually, yeah, what's 0.5? How much, how many calories do we have? 600, so I need to eat before I sleep, but I'll definitely um, use the old, uh... whoa, it's dark in here, guys. So I better, I better get sorted on torches right away. Let's do that. Oh my God, look at that. I don't know, you almost can't have enough torches. It's just one of those things. Okay, one more. And I'm going to toss a piece of coal in just to like... Oh, let's see. So we're going to sleep one hour at a time. Okay, four hours. Let's go... See, the thing is, guys, I can't get downstairs after this without the lantern. Hmm. That's problematic, but I do need to sleep. There's no two ways about it, so... Looks like we're going to be costing another match. What do we have for water? We're pretty good. Um, although we do need to... What's the food situation? A lot of sketchy food. Um, that I should eat soon, but I don't have any... Antibiotics, so... Did I check the, uh... Yeah, I did. Okay. 
See, I don't want to have to light a match to get out of here. That's the thing. That might happen. Um, what am I going to do? Let's see. Let's see our clothing. What's the story? So the hat... Wool's always better, in my opinion, but what do I know? Okay, let's start to do a repair. A sewing kit. I didn't find a sewing kit and all that. Oh, that's too bad, because this stuff's really on edge. Being on the blizzard probably didn't help. Just switching these ones around so that the, uh, the stronger ones are outside. Ugh. Okay, well, I might as well tear this thing down, I guess. Or what if I lose one of these? Doesn't matter. I'll tear this thing down. So we have cloth on the go. And, okay, got nice out. But I do want to sleep here because the next stop is, uh, you know, CH, right? So it's, it's a long haul. Okay, so let's call that... 2.5 liters. Um, and I'm going to have to use a match to get out of here. So let's... Yeah, we're going to... Okay, tell you what. Just to be safe, because I don't really know how this is going to play. Drop a coal in. And I'm just going to go with that. Let's get rid of this thing. Five hours. Um, huh, Torch-wise, I'm really set up, right? Yeah. Well, pretty pretty well set up. I mean, I could just read and get rid of all these books, but then I have to sleep for like 30 hours. Sewing primer is the one I'd want to get rid of. Five hours, right? Ugh. I think it's a bit early on for that, although I don't know if I want to haul it with me. In the end, the sewing primer is kind of... I don't really know how useful it is. Okay, so enough diddling. Let's go... Um, let's go sleep. I can't get too match... Uh, cheap, because... You know, we got lots, so... So I'm going to sleep for five hours. We'll see what happens. That should heal me up completely. Oh wow, that's dark, guys. So yeah, the storm lantern's going to be desirable. Uh, what's it going to be for? Okay, I got more calories. So it's so hungry in my life. Yeah, unfortunately, we're going to have to starve, my friend. It's it's going to be the way of this. I have to remember. I have to learn to starve again. Do another four hours. Why not? A bit ballsy, I guess. It might get cold. Let's just see. Nope. It's 35 degrees in here, guys. But we're fully rested. And I think... Let's just see where we're at. 39 minutes. Okay, let's try to push a little bit longer here. Find my way out of here. These windows do help. Okay, let's go, guys. Okay, it's cold. We're gonna go down the back. Probably should have checked that a little more carefully for uh, for stuff, but it almost looks pre-blizzard. There's the wolf, so try to give him some some wide berth here. Oh, that's a close loon, guys. Wow. Yeah, so one of the things is um, on Interloper versus the Relentless Night playthrough I had otherwise, 
the wolves are myopic. Um, basically, with my relentless night run, I had sent the wolves. I had set the wolves to be. Oh no, can't do it. Set the wolves to be um, stalker wolves, so they can see far, smell far. Regular interloper, I think, is a bit more of a break. It's like wolves just can't see as far. So we're gonna hustle. I'm gonna go up uh, and a secluded corner here, or whatever it is. Oh, somebody secluded corner. I feel like there are many secluded corners in this game. Okay, so the wind shelter does matter a lot. I'm actually a little divided about the starvation because in early game you find so much food that... And I kind of want the... Uh, the bonuses. And I tell you what, let's do it. Gotta get some more tinder plugs. Here's the thing, I'm carrying so much. Like early on, I actually kind of want the... Let's uh, drop a coal on. I, I want the uh, well-fed buff actually. Get rid of that thing. So let's see what's on this guy. Not much. But we're gonna do a couple rabbits to amp it up. Do like a little water and let's get a rabbit. And uh, I'm just kind of thinking like you know when it's nighttime I'm always like oh I should be on the move but. Truth is, like with this mode, it's like, oh, there's a suit. It's permanently the same way, right? So there's no like incentive one way or the other for. Oops, that was dumb. And no incentive one way or the other for like. Okay, it is very cold outside of the. Okay, I may have to let those guys come back to me. Yeah, I scared them. Let's see what that soup is all about. They're all in the 40s. It's not It's not a great soup situation. When I get some reishis going, I'll uh, change it up. And so what I was thinking of doing, actually, believe it or not, was 29. What if I do this, guys? Uh, I got to unfreeze him first to, in order to... A little bit of waiting here, fortunately. Hour. want that rabbit. He's toying with me though. There's two of them and they're both toying with me. Almost a double, eh? It's cold. Point blank to the face. Okay, let's get this. Let's get this going, guys. Um, it's very peaceful. Peaceful snowfall. So I normally say you live and die by your buffs, and that's true here for sure. But I'm, I'm thinking actually now it's like you live and die by your coal. Looks like it might be blizzarding on me. Possibly. Yep. It's gonna do that thing where it switches around on you in order to uh, knock your fire out. Well, that's kind of a bummer, I'll tell you. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's, that's a blizzard. Oh, the wolves are still out. They don't care. So let's see this thing. Uh, 18, 26. Okay. Nasty weather. Just gonna try to wait it out, actually. Don't wanna wait too long, though. Try to jack that up a bit. So another thing is like with uh, interlopers, it's tempting not to eat, but let's take this thing off. And yeah, tempting not to eat, but like all this rabbit harvesting is actually really good for us because it's giving us our um, cooking skill. like to see this weather break a little before I move, but may not get that uh, that lucky break. What's our weight like? 22. So we're still pretty light. Um, another rabbit just spawned. You know, it's like I guess. Since you guys are spawning. Oh, he turned on me at the last minute. Sneaky guy. Well, touche. Well, loons are still out. They don't mind this. Oh. I don't deserve that. Okay, it's calming down, guys. Oh, scared by my fire. There it is. Okay, so let's... Um, I don't want to get too carried away here, guys. And the episode's going to have to end soon because i got to go, but... I just can't pass up a good rabbit, right? It is what it is, so let's take that rabbit. 20 minutes. Fifteen. That's the fifteener. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a gamble here and just do this. I don't actually know if it's gonna work. There it goes. It's almost a Rory out there. So let's drop the cedar on. Just keep this party going. Drop that on. Do another one. I know I'm kind of overdoing it on the water, but... Take another one of these. Oh, cleared. Okay, that's plenty of water. I definitely don't need any more. Let's do the last rabbit. And then we'll get the heck out of here. Uh-oh, did I lose that fire? Am I? Not quite. Oh no, lots. Okay, let's get the heck out. Okay, let's go. Beautiful, look how it opened up, eh? Oh, guys, and what's waiting for me right around the corner? Oh. Uh, I realized I could have uh, harvested those. Um... Yeah, now I think this could be a mistake. There's a leg breaker here, but it is the most direct way down.
I'd say in real life that wouldn't have been that big a deal. So there we go. Okay, let's go do this. Here's some rabbits. Oh, there's a rabbit. So I actually think I'm going to go check the church just because... Um, I don't know. As far as I'm concerned, I ain't never coming back here. And I better run because this is a, it's a bad scene. cold. It's going to be... Okay. So I'm not sure of it, but I think this is a pretty safe spot. And we'll spend a second here doing some harvest on stuff. I'd like to sleep here, but don't think it's in the cards. Would be good to make some reishis, but you know, I kind of got to make for coastal. Let's do, oh, there's a dead guy in here. That music, it's, it's blizzard music. Burn that thing. Frontier shooting guide. Go. 80 per Yeah, I don't care. Let's get that queued up. Let's do a little bit of um, quick search in the area here. What's it going to be? Not much yet. Shucks, I should have just used a coal. Like, there's no point in messing about with uh, sticks right now. And I'm just going to do that because I need to warm up quick. I can't, can't be chilling, you know? a little bit of time doing tinder tinder plug from sticks no I don't need bandages so let's do um let's get our first tea go uh yeah tea first tea let's hit the road and go find some of those uh some of these things reishis saw a bunch over here now I gotta watch my energy level, that's the one thing, because we still gotta get all the way through Coastal Highway, or to Coastal Highway. I guess energy, if I'm really tired, it's not a big deal, but... And we'll get the makings for our, an our antiseptic stuff here. The one thing that's really nice about Interloper is you can get wolf attacked, like, no problem. It's okay to get wolf attacked, you know? Enjoy it, because okay, that'll be two at least, which is good. Uh, yeah, because you you can heal it up in a day, you know? Like, you can just... I heard something. Okay, it's a rabbit. I can't resist, guys. It's coming right for me. Oh, these sneakers. Sneakers, sneakers. Got me. Just a quick peek up there in case there's a... No. I think that. Okay. Oh, well, I don't know. The food thing, maybe I'll just starve. I don't know. It's hard to live on rabbits. Like, you do a lot of work and they 
they give you very little. So I'm going to say we'll skip these guys. Keep moving. I don't want to spend too much time at this fire. Just enough to warm up and go save my game because I got to go. Got to go, got to go. Let's see what we got here. Okay, that thing's done. Let's do a little bit of this. Okay. Let's do a little of that. While that's cooking, we do another one. Just get ourselves all nice and warm. But we're getting tired. And there's no... Oh, I'm forgetting to drop these as I do them. There should just be an auto put them near. Just to save us the hell. And Okay, while that's doing it, let's do another let's get rid of this uh wound dressing. Okay. Drop it. That's all gonna be nice and hot. Now let's weather's tanking, but that's okay. Drink some water, we've got three liters. And I guess um, do one more wound dressing to get it done. That's it for wound dressings. I think we're pretty sorted. And uh, can drop that thing, I don't need it. Okay, let's get out of here. The one other thing that's amazing about Interloper is the crazy stick spawn. Absolutely off the hook stick spawn. It's so good. Like I'm used to playing low harvestable plant. So low harvestable plant is like brutal compared to this. Um, I mean the ray sheets and everything are going to be sweet. I'm super excited about it. Um, Okay, so we're going to make for Connecting Cave, or we're going to call it an episode. Because uh, I'm running late here. It's like I'm, my life is busy now, and I'm just trying to like squeeze episodes in here and there. But it's one of those things, you know, like... I shouldn't be spending so much time on it, but... I love it. What can I say? I love this game. This is a great game. And, and you know, Aaron jumped in, and it's kind of fun having a competition, because... I, it's funny, like, this game... I think of as like a solo game, you know, it's a game about solitude, you know, like, and when folks ask for multiplayer, I'm like, I don't, this doesn't really make sense in this context. I agree with Raphael on that. I think it's, it's fundamentally a solitary game, but we still find ourselves comparing our runs. You know, there's a social element we create because, you know, you don't want to be totally solitary. So uh, I still think it's a little weird, like to have a duel, so to speak. It's more like, you know, we can have these journeys in parallel. I would like to think of it as, but, um, but we can call it a duel. It's a duel. And uh, hopefully the best man wins. Or the luckiest man, I think. Probably more like it. But uh, I'm, I'm going to have my work cut out for me. Because Aaron is... Um, obviously, he's a solo player. Like, and I've just seen him... The first episode, I was like, this guy is not afraid of wolves. Like, just leading them around in circles. I honestly... Wolves... As soon as I see a wolf, I get scared. As soon as I see a bark, I kind of panic, man. And like... I've just seen him work the wolves, and it's impressive. Um, you know, everybody's got their own little special skills in this game, you know? Like, I look at TLDPL, is that player, the Polish player I found, and he's he's awesome. He's uh, He is an absolute demon with a rock. He will throw a rock at 50 paces and nail a wolf in the face, you know? Um, that's a skill. I can't do that. Um, he told me, he's like, don't worry about it, just, you know... One thing he told me was that for stealing deer kills, just toss a rock at it. I never thought of that. I never even considered throwing a rock at a wolf. But he does it all the time. He's got good success with it. It's uh, it's really impressive. So, um, yeah, there's a lot of different play styles, and everybody's got their own special skills. So. Turkey's skill, I don't know, but, you know, he's a great player. But I think his special skill is probably, um, you know, kicking the door in. Okay, so that's that. I'm going to actually, sorry, I'm going to redo that save just so that we have a fresh save with a fresh torch. Okay guys, so let's go out and in. 
We really start out there. Okay, so we're out and in. Now we're going to start uh, a new episode. Okay, guys, thanks a lot for watching. It's been a big pleasure. I'll catch you guys next time.